back to part four of the How to Measure Your Blood Pressure Accurately at Home series. I'm Michelle Rothenstein. I'm your cardiovascular dietitian. Today, I want to talk about which arm you should be testing at home, but I want to make sure you stay until the end of this video because I'm going to share a really important tip with you about if there is a large difference, what that may mean. Okay, so when you are testing your initial assessment of which, which arm to test, make sure that you're positioning it in the right way. So check out my last video to know which, how to position it appropriately and then test both left and right arms. There may be a slight difference between the two. If there is, don't worry. Just always check the one that is higher as, your, as the arm that you are going to be using going forward. If there is a difference of 10 to 15 or more points higher from one arm to the next, it could indicate potential vascular disease. And so if you are testing it and there is a big difference, you want to go back to your doctor for further evaluation. They should be doing an ankle brachial index to rule out peripheral artery disease and may need further testing to rule out any potential circulatory problems. Make sure that you are testing both arms and if it is higher that you go get that further testing to rule out vascular disease. Hope that's helpful. Make sure you follow along, comment below with how things are going, and I'll be sharing more tips on high blood pressure and heart disease on my page, so follow along.